don't type dates in excel like this if you want gap of seven days between the dates instead of this you can use one amazing function that is is equal to sequence then open bracket now i want 50 rows so you can type here 50 because we want 50 dates which are having seven days gap then comma and for the column you can type one because we want the sequence in one column then comma and for the start you can use date function and type the date like year i want 2024 month i want 12 and day i want one close the bracket then comma and steps i want seven because we want gap between seven days so you can close the bracket then enter see you're getting dates which are having gaps of seven days if you like this video don't forget to share this video thank you